church, wake up, take back your country. God bless you. An Islamic group, Muslim Rights Concern, Murik, has asked Peter Obi, the candidate of the Labour Party in the 2023 presidential election, if a video in which he is seen telling Christians to take back their country is also fake. The group stated this in a statement issued on Wednesday, April 12, 2023, by Professor Ishak Akintola, the executive director of the Islamic Human Rights Organization, following Peter Obi's denial of the authenticity of the leaked Yes Daddy audio tape. The audio in which Obi described the 2023 presidential election as a religious war was first published by an online newspaper. After maintaining for some days, Obi later released a statement claiming the audio call being circulated is fake and at no time throughout the campaign and now did he ever say, think or even imply that the 2023 election or was a religious war. However, Obi's claim contradicted the position of one of the spokespersons for the Labour Party Presidential Campaign Council, Kenneth Okunkwo, and the candidate's media assistant, Valentine Obiem, who had admitted the authenticity of the audio. In the video that Murik made reference to in his statement, Obi was seen addressing a congregation of some Christian faithfuls. The event was held a few months before the general election, and Obi spoke on why they should ensure competent people were elected to lead Nigeria. In the said video, Obi said, Please, the church, wake up, take back your country, God bless you. Wake up, take back your country, God bless you. Please, the church, wake up, take back your country, God bless you.